Hello internet world, welcome to a new video on the Geekanoids channel. In today's video I've got a keyboard from a company that I've actually covered before on the channel uh, and that's RE or RE Technology or RE Tech. Uh, this is their K18 Plus. It's a really good multimedia wireless keyboard or wired, you can use it in both combinations and I love the design, I really do like it. Uh, a big thank you must go out to Re for sending this out for this video. They haven't asked me to say anything in particular, nor have they asked to see the video beforehand, so all of the opinions expressed are indeed my own. Uh, this is the sort of outer sleeve of the box. Just look at this, absolutely superb. It actually works off the 2.4 gigahertz RF wireless connection. Uh, it's also uh, got multimedia, function keys across the top and a touchpad and wait till you see it turned on it's really very very good indeed now before I actually get on with the review and show you the keyboard which is just sitting here on the desk it's really looking nice before I show you the keyboard I do want to just remind you all this is a live broadcast you can use the live chat or the super chat to communicate with me throughout this video and also if you're watching after the live broadcast please do leave a comment below and please do also uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed. So here we go, this is the keyboard. Look at this, very, very cool. Look at the markings on it, it looks fantastic. Uh, very compact keyboard, very slim line, extremely well built. I absolutely love how this looks. As I mentioned earlier, we've got full function keys across the top. We've also got little uh, multimedia keys in this top corner here as well. Really nicely spaced chiclet style keys with a nice action on them, nice and quiet. Nice and quiet, very, very quiet indeed. And also, we've of course got a touchpad here as well uh, with left and right sort of mouse button click areas. So very, very nice that we've got this uh, trackpad integrated and it lends itself uh, to sort of working on a sofa, for example, maybe using it on a big screen, or indeed just on a desk or in a mobile fashion as well, perhaps you're using this on the go. Really a, a beautiful looking keyboard. Now let's just take a look around the back. We've got these rubberized feet. We've also got this little cover just here, and the cover reveals two things, an RF uh, dongle, which you plug into a spare USB port, or a captive cable. This is a wired uh, connection. Uh, now, you can also, you, you use this to actually charge the keyboard. There's no sort of a micro USB cable to lose at all. Very, very nice indeed. Now, let's just uh, cover that up and turn the keyboard on, and you can see the backlight. Oh, the backlight's turned off at the moment. Let's uh, get the backlight on. Do, 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 do. Got to find the key again, it's down here. Here we go, the backlight is now on. A uh, little backlight key just there. So you can obviously turn the backlight off, but look, green, bluey purple, orangey pink, off. I just love, when, especially this color here, this is gorgeous. This is actually red, uh, but it comes through the keys as like a orangey sort of peachy type color. It looks fantastic. Just look at how even the backlight is as well. Very, very cool. Very cool indeed. Now, just a, a little correction for you. It did sort of, I don't know what was entering my mind. This is a wireless keyboard. You can't use it wired. That cable, the integrated cable, uh, is indeed for charging the keyboard. But the typing motion, it is just really nice. It is a small keyboard. It's not a full-size keyboard, uh, but it feels very, very nice to type on. Extremely nice, I really do like that. We've also got a mouse function key just up here as well. And if you don't type for a while, to conserve battery life, the backlight will turn off. Uh, I'll just hold that up to show you that it does uh, sort of times out just to conserve battery life. Uh, now I can see 666JG knots in the live chat. Thank you very much for tuning in live. I really do appreciate it. Uh, commenting that imp this is impressive backlighting. This could be ideal for my old laptop, which does not have backlighting. Very, very good uh, suggestion there. If you have got a laptop or a computer that hasn't got a backlit keyboard, and you're, there you go, there's that backlight turning off to conserve battery. So as I was saying, if you haven't got a keyboard with backlighting, 
and you want something to use, maybe not as your full-time keyboard, but maybe as a backup for when you're working late at night, this could be a really good choice. Very, very good indeed. Love the typing experience and love the build quality. I can certainly recommend this because it is just superb. I really have fallen in love with it. Well done to Reed. This is absolutely brilliant. Please do check out the links down in the video description area to where you can pick this up for yourself. If you enjoyed the video, of course, please do hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. New tech videos pretty much every single day. Been doing a lot of coverage on cameras of late and indeed I've got another camera review coming up next week. So do stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching everyone. Have a fantastic Friday and a fantastic weekend ahead and I'll see you all in the next one. That is a really great keyboard. Absolutely love it.